Okay, so this is the uh, prototype, the beta uh, number two. Uh, so you can see that it uh, works pretty good. And uh, so we can adjust the brightness here so it's not blinding you at night. And then uh, this is the speed control. So if you want to change it from low to high, you can change the speed there. But you can also do all this on, on the app. So we go to, uh, right now we're using Blue Connect. And then we look up uh, the uh, Adafruit Blue Fruit here. Okay. And then pick the uh, controller app here. Okay. Controller pad. All right. And now we can. you can see that uh, the blue light's on, so we're connected. And uh, you can control the motor with left to right here. And then this is the speed up or down. So if we turn it all the way down, you can see it's going really slow. You can actually take one tick at a time. And if you speed it up, go much much faster Bluetooth hand controller here and I can actually run and focus remotely See there. and also another feature on on the handset is that you can push both buttons to reset the counter to zero okay and uh, the on off button is here so anytime you use this, if you're going to unplug the power, make sure you turn it off first. So turn the power off, then you can unplug it. Same thing with the motor. Don't, don't unplug either of these without turning off the power first. Okay, that can cause a, a uh, voltage spike. I've built in enough capacitors to hopefully take care of that, but uh, there's no reason to actually risk that. So, um, and it doesn't matter which way you plug this in um, I put in a bridge rectifier so that uh, the positive can be the tip or the positive can be the ring so it, it doesn't matter because uh, I hate to see stuff burn up just because somebody uses the <laughs> backwards power supply but uh, no worries here so it just takes 12 volts plus or minus it doesn't matter okay well I hope you guys enjoy this and uh, we'll talk to you guys later bye bye